MWA proudly brings to you a classic clip from Shooting the Shit. Yeah, obviously, you know, you, you know, obviously you, you were saying working with Melina has been a great help and, and obviously to where you are at now. Um, being the NWA women's champion, when, when did they come to you and say, hey, this is going to be your time, uh, we're going to be putting the belt on you? Um, you know, and, and what was said to you? Would, have they said how long they plan to have you as the champion? Obviously, I don't want you to tell us future storylines. Listen, right man, if I knew, I wouldn't tell you anyways, okay? Hey, <laughs> no, 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 no. I, I'm not saying, trying to tell us to give us a, any anything that... You know, I honestly, I honestly, if you ask me, uh, I'm going to tell you straight up the truth, I have no clue. But when, I did have they, no clue. When, when did they come to you and say, we're going to be making you the champion? You're going to be the face of this division. I'm going to tell you right now. When I stepped on that ring that first time and you guys heard those drums, everybody should have known that that was my time. Yeah. Straight up. Well, you know why? Because nobody else believed in Thunder Rosa but the NWA. Everybody else will give me a mask. They have me be doing all Lucha stuff, which I have no problem with because I love Lucha. Which mm. is part of my culture. And you know what? I'm an athlete. So you tell me what to do. I learn it because I'm an athlete and because I love wrestling and I speak wrestling. So mm. I don't give a crap. If I go to Japan, I learn the Japanese style. You know why? Because I love wrestling and because I respect their culture. They send me to Mexico. I will learn lucha. You know why? Because I want to work that style and because mm. I love wrestling. Now in MMA, guess what? I got to learn to do so. <laughs> <laughs> and struggling, and everything else. Fun. You know why? Because I love it now. I love fighting, and it's pretty dope. You know. Oh, so, absolutely. Going back to your question, <laughs> um, <laughs> Lagana had a vision for me, but I didn't know what it was going to be. But when, when they saw me, how much passion, how much effort, how much everything. I put it in the ring that first time, just coming out of the ring, like coming out in, into the in, into the studio. No music, nothing. It was just me and the people in the ring. It was magic. It was instantaneous. Like many people, were, they were waiting for that moment to happen. I was waiting for that moment to happen. My husband was waiting for that moment to happen. When my face came out on the NWA, on, on the entrance, uh, like the, you know, when they're like presenting the, the show into the fire, I started crying because that was the first time that something that we created, that we believe in, that many people believe in, and something that um that is very ingrained in me as a person, as, as, as Melissa Cervantes, was presented to the world with, you know, no, with, with no limitations. Yeah. And you show who Thunder Rosa really was. And that's what made Thunder Rosa get over. Because that's who I really am, you know? I'm a fucking fighter. I'm a warrior. I don't give up. Even when I have the fucking worst days in the world and I feel like crap. That's one thing I learned in life is never giving up. No matter how difficult things are. When I got my fight, I got my ass handed. I got my fucking face cut. Guess what? I could have fallen to a, a fallen to a ball and let the girl fucking beat me up and TK, and TKO me. But you know what I did? I got up. They cleaned my face and I told my coach, "Am I doing well? Okay, cool. I have one more round. Okay, I'm gonna keep going and have fun because I'm not giving up." That's what I did. Cause all the odds were against me, and all the odds have always been against me. And I have this peanut butter thing in my hand right now because I'm like on it. But you know what? I never given up. In that time, the first time I got in the ring in NWA. I said, I'm here because everybody said no to me. And guess what? I'm here to be undeniably one of the best wrestlers in the world. And everybody's going to see it because it's on YouTube and it's for free. And if you haven't seen it, go and see it. 